Hello, today I'm going to show you the Flashcards Plus app. And you start by clicking the icon and then it brings you to this screen. And it will allow you the options to add a deck or show your recent decks that you've been working on or show the decks that you've made. And the decks that I've made is this one and it's chapter 41. Something I don't like about this app is even after you've made note cards, it still shows up as zero. But as you can see, I've made three right here. And you look at them and it gives you the option to make the text smaller or bigger if you need to. And it also gives you the option to shuffle the cards and I like that because it allows you to not memorize the order of the cards but look at them in a different order every time. And so gives live birth. Let's see, that's viviparous. And you can go, you can say, if you learn it, you put this check mark right here and it gives you a check on the card and sends you to the next one. And it lays eggs. I don't know the answer to that. Let's look at it. It's oviparous. And so we'll go to the next one since I haven't learned that one. It carries eggs and hatch eternally and are born live. I'm not quite sure what that one is either, so I go to oviparous. And then you double click it and you can go back and it shows you this is the only one that I know. And then you can go to the ones to learn and it will show you only the ones without a check mark. And then you just study the rest of those and then they'll all end up in the learned pile, which is only that one. And you can go back and back again and you can make a new deck and it gives you these options to see decks that have already been made but I don't have internet right now so it doesn't work but you can make your own deck by clicking custom and then you make a deck name and then we're going to say it's biology and then the subject is also biology and you can give a description of your deck or not you can save it either way and then say the question that you want to ask it tells you that the front is right there and you can say order crocodilia okay but it's not that and so then you go down here and you put your answer so you put crocodile and that's an example of crocodilia and you save it and then you go back you go back to your deck, you look right here and it adds your new deck and you click it and it gives you your card just like that and you can go in and you can edit your card, order crocodile and you want to add the word example because it's an example and that's what you want your question to be and you save it just like that and then you can go back and you look at your deck and say okay I've learned this deck and I'm tired of taking up space on my thing so I want to delete it. You click edit click this button right here and you click delete and then it asks you if you're sure you want to delete the whole deck and you say delete it and it's gone and so now all you're working with is this one right here and then you can go back and if you have any questions you click this information button right here and it shows you an index of help and it shows you how to view your deck, how to add decks, how to edit it, delete it, all that kind of good stuff and you can close it out and you can go back and if you want to you can have your card read it to you just like this and it gives you whatever language that you want it, but you have to buy it. And that's another thing I don't like. But, go back, and then keep going back, go back to your deck, and you still have your biology one. And after you delete that one, you can't get it back. And that's all for this. Tune in and check out the rest of our videos. Thanks.